Danny, what's the most dangerous site you've ever excavated on, and what made it perilous? Oh boy, that's a good question. Um, honestly, the most dangerous thing out in the field is driving. Uh, I think just by the numbers. I think more paleontologists have died behind the wheel than have ever been killed by lightning or rattlesnakes or anything like that. But if you're talking about like stuff on site once you arrive, any place where you've got a whole lot of rock being removed and a lot of people, you know, swinging picks around and throwing rocks from shovels and stuff like that, there's always a chance that somebody's going to get going to get hurt. Like I said, lightning, dehydration, but you know, we try to be as careful as we can in a place like this. It's not like we have a hospital next door. There have been times when I've been like clambering up the side of a cliff and there's just a huge gust of wind and I've almost fallen down. There's been lots and lots of times like that, especially when I'm out prospecting.